So this is part four of the four-part series of tying into a rope for glacier travel. We've set up our harness, we've set up the rope, we've tied into it, and now I have this bundle of rope here because I'm either the first or last climber on the rope team, and I need to coil it up using a mountaineer's coil. To do that, I'm going to start at my knot, not at the end of the rope, and I'm going to pass it over my body, making the coil the appropriate size for me. Do yourself a favor, make your own coil. Don't let someone else do it for you. So I'm simply passing it over my shoulder, holding it here in my left hand with, at the length that I'd like it to be. If I was wearing a pack, this would be a slightly different size. If I was taller or shorter, this coil would be a slightly different size. And I'm just gonna keep repeating this motion until I've collected all of the rope to make my mountaineer's coil. There we go. So now I'm going to take the rope off my shoulder, using the strand leading directly to my figure eight. I'm going to turn the coil to put this bite in the rope. Then I'm going to take the very end of the rope and wrap it around through the coil, working toward that bite that I just made. After going around a few times, I'm going to pass the very end of the rope through that bite, grab my knot, and pull on it, and it will tighten that down. Now this is secure, and it can go over my shoulder, and I'm ready to climb.